Welcome to the GetJar video tutorial on uploading your app's assets. Start by logging into the developer zone at developer.getjar.com. Go to publishing, click on my applications, and then click on new app or site. We're going to go through these options one at a time, but before we start I wanted to point out that our default listing language is English. By using this box over here, you can add as many other languages as you'd like. Simply select a language and click Add. Note that if you do add a language, you will have to complete all sections before clicking the next page. That includes all required sections for each language. For the purposes of this tutorial, I'm just going to do English. Your app at link is a unique URL that you can use anywhere you want. You can put it on a t-shirt, on your website, in an email, literally on anything, and if someone gets to that link on their mobile phone, they are only two clicks away from downloading your app. Note that it should be unique, and you can only use alphanumeric characters and simple dashes. Name of my app is Peaceful Penguins. Your application name is obviously the name of your application. And here you're limited to 50 characters. Next is the list description. This text shows up in mobile browsing and you're limited to 100 characters. Your text description is what shows up on your app's unique product page. Here you get 1,000 characters to give your app a bit of a more robust description. However, for this tutorial, I'm just going to keep it simple. Next, we're going to ask you for screenshots. While we only require one, we recommend uploading as many as you can because it makes your app just that much more attractive to a potential user. Note that the max file size here is 400 by 800 pixels and 50 kilobytes in size. Next we're going to choose icons. Here we actually are going to require all three because we don't want to stretch or minimize your logo at any point during the GetJar experience. The file sizes are down here below and each of the three is different. Last on this page we're going to ask you to choose a category so click the down arrow and find the best fit for you. Note that after you choose your category a subcategory box appears. Click the down arrow and choose the one that's most appropriate for your app. If you can't find one that you really like, choose more games or more finance or whatever category you're in, and that will be your subcategory. Once you click next, you'll either see this green box letting you know you were successful, or a box letting you know where any errors may be. And that's it for this video. Next, we're going to show you how to upload your build.